Need some help deciding which payment method to use when hosting online events? Over 300 million people use Zoom. That's mostly thanks to the COVID-19 pandemic. But we've quickly learned just how convenient and effective virtual meetings and events can be. Even as we slowly move towards a post-COVID world, it's likely that virtual events won't be going anywhere soon. And if you already charge fees or want to implement a registration fee when hosting an event or webinar, you'll need a way to collect those payments. I'm Alex with Jotform, and in today's video, we'll discuss how to use Zoom's only integrated payment gateway offering, PayPal, as well as a few other useful payment methods worth looking into. Let's get into it. Zoom truly makes gathering payments easy for its users by integrating PayPal. You do need a PayPal account as well as a Zoom video webinar plan to use this option. It's so simple. You can easily collect fees for your webinars as part of the Zoom registration form. All you have to do is enable registration fees on your Zoom account and then switch on fees for each webinar you want to charge a fee for. Then, as your registrants fill out their webinar registration form, they will then click on Pay and Register and be directed to PayPal to pay the registration amount. If you want a payment process that's already set up for you, Zoom and PayPal are great choices. However, one potential downside is that your customers can't choose their payment method. Perhaps your customers don't have PayPal set up or are based in a different country that PayPal doesn't support. In these instances, you may want to try an alternative method. But if the Zoom and PayPal integration doesn't work for your business, that's okay. Here are three alternative Zoom payment methods that still give you an easy way to collect fees for Zoom webinars. Our first alternative option is connecting your payment gateway to Zoom through an application programming interface or API. If you have a tech savvy team, you could just build a custom API connection. If your team isn't that tech savvy, this option can still be easy for you to set up. All you have to do is use an automation tool. Zapier, Integromat, or Automate.io are all capable of connecting your payment gateway to Zoom. These tools come with ready-to-use API integrations with hundreds of apps, including Zoom, and a wide range of payment gateways. Users have utilized Zapier to connect to Stripe, which processes all webinar payments. It makes checkout easy and intuitive. This is how it works. First, you'd pick a trigger. In this case, it'd be receiving a payment through Stripe. Then, the resulting action you'd choose to automate is registering the payee for a webinar on Zoom. Therefore, when your webinar attendees register, they make their payment through your chosen payment gateway, and your automation tool will do the rest of the work signing them up for the webinar. Another alternative option is Jotform. If you want to maximize the number of payment options your registrants can use, then Jotform is for you. This online form builder not only makes creating forms easy, but also collects payments in a number of ways. Jotform's form builder allows you to connect to one of their 30 plus payment gateway options. Without paying any additional transaction fees, you can offer multiple payment options to your registrants. Here's how Jotform works. First, you'll create and set up your registration form so you can gather necessary info like the registrant's name, email address, and company name. You can either create a customized form or utilize an already existing Jotform webinar registration template. While creating your form, you'll also add your payment buttons for your chosen gateways. Then, once a webinar participant submits their registration form and completes their payment, Jotform's Zoom integration will automatically collect their data and add them as a registrant for your event. It's that simple. Our last alternative payment method is to use event management software. This is a pretty hands-off option. The event management software will do most of the heavy lifting. However, because of this, they also often take a percentage of the payments you process. Let's get into how it works. Event management software like Eventbrite takes event registrations, accepts online payments, and even promotes your virtual events in their public directory. Although each platform supports a different payment gateway, they all do relatively the same functions. First, you create a listing for your online event on their platform. Then, the platform collects registrations and payments at the same time. The system then automatically emails the Zoom webinar link to people who complete the registration and payment process successfully. So, 
Whether you're tech savvy and want to integrate Zoom and a payment process yourself, or you want a more hands-off and automated approach, there is a payment method out there for you. Let's do a quick review. If you want to collect payments for online events, here are four ways to do so. You can use the built-in Zoom payment gateway, PayPal. You can connect your payment gateway to Zoom with an API. You can create and collect registrations and payments with JotForm, or you can use an event management software like Eventbrite. Thanks for watching. I'm Alex and this is JotForm. We'll see you again soon.